morning this mess you see before you is the defrost board from my ICP night and day uh, heat pump. It failed and you can see a previous video of what was wrong with it. Uh, since then I have repaired it. I have replaced this diode, these capacitors, this capacitor, this transistor, this relay, and although I didn't need to, I replaced this chip. And um, I have this thing set up it's wired into this thermostat like it would be if it was uh, actually in use. The um, light here is your reversing solenoid and the um, this is hooked up to a continuity so when I turn on continuity that's going to hear, hear a beep and I'm going to show you how the uh, basically how the, this thing should work and uh, I'm not going to sit here and make it run through its actual time because it takes it can take 30 minutes I'm going to use the, uh, the speed up function Let's see if we can make this turn on. Uh, it's cool. That's heat. Alright, it's turned on the heat. The basic gist of this is when heat is turned on, power comes into the R and the Y, and this T1 connection has to receive power and so I've got the T1 hooked into the Y and then the defrost thermostat has to sense that the heat is on before it starts counting so we'll simulate that with a switch and as you can see it is now counting it's a the this timer chip it's set to 30 minutes and when it reaches 30 minutes I can speed this up but when it reaches 30 minutes it's going to turn off this and it's going to turn on that so we'll simulate that here And there you go. So it turned off this, which is the fan, and turned on the reversing solenoid, which turns heat off, turns AC on, but doesn't turn the fa exhaust fan on. And it will do this, it'll hold this for 10 minutes, or until the thermostat reaches whatever the temperature it's supposed to be, like 80 degrees or something like that, and I can simulate that by just turning this switch off and it goes back to to heat and that's the basic way that this is this works um, so now I have a spare defrost board that works and um, we're all good. So, it's a really quick video. Thanks for watching.